Hey guys, today we are making vegetarian Hakka noodles. For this, you will require noodles which are boiled as per the packet instructions. Next, you will require some bean sprouts, purple cabbage, carrots, onions, cabbage and spring onions. After that, some bell peppers will be required. All of the vegetables should be cut in julienne's. Then you need chili powder, chili flakes, pepper, minced garlic, soya sauce and salt to taste. Then you need to heat your wok. Set it on a big burner with the highest flame because most of the food in the Chinese cuisine requires a lot of fire. Then you want to let it heat up. After that you can add the oil. Then swirl the oil around the wok. Remember the wok should be very hot. Then add the onions and the minced garlic. Once that's done, you can add the carrots in. Also, if you are new to our channel, welcome. Please make sure to press that subscribe button so that you will be notified whenever we post a video. Now coming back to the video, after tossing the carrots around, add the bell peppers. Also, if you don't have all the vegetables, it's fine. You can just use whatever vegetables you have out of these. But if you do have all of them, it just makes the noodles tastier, healthier and more colorful. Now you can add your cabbages. If you're wondering, this is not a traditional Chinese noodles recipe. This is my mom's modified recipe because it's been modified to the family's taste. Also, all the ingredients will be put in the description box below along with their quantities. Then add the salt, the pepper and the chili flakes or powder. Then you want to nicely toss them around the wok. Now add the bean sprouts. Once you are finished tossing the vegetables around the wok, you can go get your boiled noodles. Add the noodles into the wok and then you can toss them around. Once that's done, you can add the soya sauce. Here, if you wish, you can add green chili paste to make it spicier. And you can add ketchup if you like it, but we don't like either so we didn't add. You can also add a Ginomoto which is a flavor enhancer, but as it's not healthy, we don't like it. Then add the spring onions just before you off the flame. Now toss the noodles around for the final touch. I hope you liked our recipe for vegetarian Hakka noodles. If you liked it, don't forget to share it with your family and friends so that they can enjoy it as well. Thanks for watching this video. See you in the next one.